So just got out of um, custody for being arrested for um, trespassing at the um, Royal Hawaiian Golf Course this morning. Um, the, uh, it was very heated today. Um, Anela, Anel Amaral came and said to take them all away, basically. Um, to, um, she told the cops to come and take us away. Um, the cops are very, very cooperative, but um, unfortunately, um, the people inside there weren't. <laughs> And uh, we were arrested uh, today for trespassing and uh, have our court date next month. So um, hopefully, we're hoping that some of those people in there at the AHA will see the light and will recognize that the process that they're in is in Heva and that nothing really can come out of that process, nothing. And they should not be creating a governing document as well. And this is my Tita who got arrested with me. And uh, it was, uh, it was. We're we're, um, we're hoping that um, this will raise awareness about how heavy this process is. Mahalo, my tita over here. You know, we started this whole thing because we were concerned about the future of our Kiki, yeah. and that we yeah. not just our Kiki, but we were. We were really concerned about the future of all the keiki that are not on the roll, right? You know, that, yeah. that we couldn't sign up for something that would make it about our children versus other people's children. Yeah. That it just... Yeah. Nothing good can come out of this process. It's Look at how they treated us. <laughs> they sick the cops on us. Mm -hmm. So, um, I mean, it's just totally have all, all the way around. Any process that has to deal with laws, constitutions, um, governments, if they don't have the heart and soul of the will of the people, if they don't have come from a basis of love and caring for the people, if they start off being afraid of the people and have to lock themselves up being in a golf course in order to create a government, I mean, just take it. You know, all of us need to take a step back. We aloha so many of the people mm -hmm. in there. And we, you know, we have our friends, we have family members, we have people that we care about, who love and are passionate about our communities. But just think about that. Yeah. What kind of government will come out of a process that starts off with locking your people up and when, you, when the people who are not a part of the process just want to be recognized mm -hmm. by this government and say, we simply want to deliver a declaration, they will vote it down, vote down the voice of, 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 of the people and have us arrested. Right. All they needed to do is three minutes to read the declaration and just let it go on the floor and that was denied. This is a government that is being born and built right now for our people. Yeah. It's, oh, it's, it's not ready. Uh, so hopefully, you know, this will raise consciousness among our people about really the purpose of this process. It's there's not a it, there is no good purpose when it's behind closed walls, closed doors, and gates, and and our people are being locked out. And um, we, it was, it was very heated today. I mean, there's things were said to us that was very wrong by the delegates themselves, and um, we were treated badly by them. Um, and we, some of us were pushed and shoved. Um, so it was very, um, it was just so not right with how they're treating us. And all we're trying to do is say, you know what? You guys should not be in there creating a governing document. That's not self-determination. That is not what our queen wanted. That's definitely not. She would have been ashamed of what they're doing in there. So she is a queen, by the way, Jay Dana. She's not an elite, she's a queen. <laughs> I do all of the ones. There are some of those who are in there who really fought very hard, who fought 
to try and have this voice be heard in in the Na'iyaw Puni Aha, but they are outnumbered. And that's something that's very concerning, that the voices of inclusion, the voices of justice, the voices of the people who want to include all of our people, that they are outnumbered and shouted down. Yeah. Uh, so my aloha to all of our, those who came and stood with us at the gates, my aloha to you. Yeah. We want us to let you guys know that at the Aha Aloha Aina, um, that is only for all the people. <laughs> who Bron Santo might be protesting, by the way. <laughs> Uh, yes, Fran Santo said that he would protest our own. Our right. Our but but our, what's the point? There's no locked gate. And everybody's welcome. And we got free food too. So <laughs> <laughs> come my Aloha mahalo for everybody's support and we'll see you on Thursday. Yeah, thanks.